As we mark our 75th anniversary, we're taking a look back at some of St. Louis's biggest stories and celebrations. In 2019, it didn't get any better than the Blues and their Stanley Cup journey. Our Frank Cusimano relives their historic road to Gloria. For over 50 years, hockey fans in our town had been waiting to claim the greatest trophy in sports. Before 2019, the Blues were known more for their heartbreaks and disappointments than their triumphs. But with one glorious fairy tale season, all that changed. I remember being there on the ice in Boston and at the parade down Market, trying to convince myself it wasn't a dream. Thankfully, it wasn't. For much of the 2018-2019 blue season, it looked like the same old story. An underperforming team with another fired coach and another lost year. With the fewest points in all of the NHL on January 2nd, the Blues needed a miracle. And with Craig Berube at the helm and an unknown Jordan Bennington getting his chance in net, they got one. The funny thing was, the miracles kept coming. A little girl fighting her own battle inspired a city. I won my part, they're going to win their part. They support me, I support them. A song became more than just a rallying cry. A hometown hero was born. Baparoo just put the city on his shoulders. And in a Stanley Cup final for the ages, the Blues finally reached that championship mountaintop. For the first time in their history, the St. Louis Blues are the Stanley Cup champions. St. Louis spent the summer celebrating and finally got Bobby Plager his long-awaited parade. Coolest thing I've ever done. I can't believe the support from this crowd, the people here. That's all you want. It's not just the guys that laced them up and the stat like it's every single person in the city that just kept sticking with us. Beginning of the year, when we were in last place, people still bought tickets, still came to watch us. And June of 2019 became a moment in time our city will never forget. Look around right now, we're Stanley Cup champs, baby! Wow. It doesn't seem like even a few it, years ago. It seems like yesterday. Yeah, it yeah. does. I can still feel the champagne all over my body. Yeah. <laughs> this Braden Shen is spraying me to death. Guys. It, it is so nice, though, that we were able to do that. We, the Blues, were able to do that before we lost Bobby Plague. Yeah. 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 And, you know, I got to tell you that even though we've covered World Series and Super Bowls, that story, if you factor in how long it took, 53 years, it was the best sports story I've ever covered. Yeah, yeah it was yeah. it was a lot of fun. All right, Frank, thanks right, for nice. those memories. Good memories.